The Easy Slicer from Nemco is the one slicer you need to make fast, easy work of most fruits and vegetables. In seconds, you can produce mounds of uniformly sliced fresh vegetables for salad bars, sandwiches, pizza toppings and more, all with minimal training and big savings in time and labor. Its adjustable stainless steel blade provides a full range of slicing options, from 1 16th inch to 1 half inch in thickness for maximum versatility and convenience. This instructional video is not intended to take the place of the supplied written instructions. Please take the time to read through the instructions thoroughly and become familiar with the operating and maintenance procedures. We will be using the standard mounting base that comes with each unit. It is attached to the work table with the screws provided in the mounting kit. Also available is the Nemco Easy Mounting Board, a handy optional accessory. The NSF approved mounting board is held firmly to any smooth surface with heavy duty suction cup feet. It is easily removed for cleaning or storage with a simple effort free tug on each cup's pull tab. Now we will begin the demonstration by sliding the Easy Slicer into the mounting base and tightening the locking screw to secure the machine. Check the slice thickness setting. Remove the adjustable slicing unit by turning the shaft lock to the left and pulling on the handle. The slice thickness is easily adjusted by holding the handle stationary and by turning the adjusting screw at the end of the adjusting shaft assembly. The thickness of the slice is indicated by the alignment of the pin in the slot and the lines on the recessed portion of the main shaft. These lines are 1 16th of an inch apart, so 2 lines equals 2 16ths of an inch or 1 8th of an inch, 3 lines equals 3 16ths of an inch, etc., up to 1 half inch. Simply turn the thumb screw to lock in your setting on the easy to read calibrated gauge. Now pull out the pusher handle, raise the cover plate and place your produce into the trough. Close the cover plate and gently push on the pusher handle knob while turning the handle on the rotary cutting unit in a clockwise direction. You may want to turn the handle about a quarter turn counterclockwise before turning in the cutting direction. This will permit a running start as the blade makes its first cut. Maintain uniform pressure on the pusher handle. Heavy pressure is unnecessary and will not improve the slicing or shredding action. As you can see, it is very fast and easy to achieve very uniform slices with clean cut edges. The Easy Slicer was designed for easy disassembly for cleaning as follows. Turn the shaft lock assembly to the left and pull the rotary slicing unit out of the trough and leg assembly. Lift the guard off of the trough and leg assembly. Loosen the locking screw and remove the trough and leg assembly from the mounting base. After cleaning, return the trough and leg assembly to the mounting base and tighten the locking screw. Slide the guard onto the trough and leg assembly and then slide the rotary slicing unit into the trough and leg assembly. Turn the shaft lock assembly clockwise to the right to lock the rotary slicing assembly into the trough and leg assembly. You will want to periodically clean the shaft lock bore with the brass brush provided with the Easy Slicer to assure that the shaft lock assembly turns freely. To remove the shaft lock for cleaning, rotate the shaft lock assembly to the left to release the rotary slicing assembly. Slide the rotary slicing assembly out of the trough and leg assembly. Remove the guard. Pull the shaft lock pin to release the shaft lock. Pull the shaft lock out of the trough and leg assembly. Use the supplied brush to clean the shaft lock channel. For a written version of these instructions, please refer to the cleaning instructions available online or in the literature provided with each new machine. Replace the shaft lock into the trough and leg assembly. Return the shaft lock pin through the trough and leg assembly and shaft lock. Be certain that the shaft lock is fully seated into the channel and then rotate it to the right or clockwise. To prolong the sharpness of your blades, they can be honed as follows. Remove the rotary slicing unit from the trough and leg assembly. Adjust to the maximum slice width, one half inch. Use a fine honing stone on the beveled side of the blade. Move the stone parallel to the blade's grain 
and work along the curve of the blade. Be sure to maintain the original sharpening angles on the beveled side of the blade. If needed, use the hone on the flat side of the blade to remove burrs. A honing stone is available from Nemco for this purpose. In order to replace the slicer blades, remove the rotary slicing unit from the machine as for cleaning and secure it in a vise. Using a screwdriver, remove the flathead screws releasing the blades. We highly recommend using cut-resistant gloves during this procedure. These blades are extremely sharp. Some of you may only require a single size cut and an adjustable unit may not be required. Nemco offers fixed cut machines available in widths of 1 8 inch, 3 16 inch, and a quarter inch. There are also two shredder blades available in widths of 3 16 inch and 5 16 inch. Control your portions, save time, reduce your labor costs, and maximize your menu capabilities with the versatility of the Easy Slicer from Nemco. For more information about this or our other fine Nemco products, contact us at Nemco Food Equipment or visit us online at www.nemcofoodequip.com.